No, this is not the solo leveling killer. Don't get baited by the title, okay? I'm just baiting you guys. Listen, listen. Uh, this is a show that's based... The only similarity between solo leveling this is the fact that it's getting an anime based off of the webtoon. We're getting a lot of webtoon content being made into anime. I know that there's like High School of, you know, High School of God or, you know, there's like Tower of God and there's other shows. But it's really cool to see, you know, webtoon content actually get more anime hype and get more popular because... I'm kind of sick and tired of reacting to goddamn shitty isekais every goddamn season. We need some variety. And we haven't even got the regression webtoons that Giguk has been hyping us about. And when we've done farming all of that shit throughout the next five years, do you know what hits next? The Man Hua from our Chinese neighbors with the cultivations, but that's for it later. Anyways, this is called Viral Hit, an anime about bullying, streaming, content creation. There's a chicken man. I don't know. Let's check it out. I thought this said Fuda for a second. My new stream, Viral Hit Channel begins. My life is pure darkness, it's hell. Right, because he's like, <laughs> this is called New Tubu. <laughs> Why is that a chicken there, bro? <laughs> By the way, something f Dude, some, some motherfucker came to my video on like a blue archive or some shit, was like, bro, you gotta watch, you gotta watch Viral Hit, bro, Viral Hit, Viral Hit. And then he left a third comment saying, By the way, I forgot to mention the blonde guy looks like you! This guy? What? Just because it's a webtoon? Because this guy's Korean? And I am? You racist! Racist! That's what I tell you! Come on! That, that's me? Y'all are doing me so fucking dirty! Why couldn't she have said I look like this guy, dude? This guy looks fucking cool, bro! What? Why the yellow hair guy? That was three fucking replays or a kick. New Tubu. <laughs> Even the play buttons. Well, I flipped. Thank you, 700,000 subscribers. Wow! Oh. This is a high school student? This is a high... He doesn't look as bad as some other high school students in anime. Like, for example, Mahoka right now, Jumonji. Or even, like, Albert from Classroom of the Elite. Bro is not a high school student. <sighs> Rumi's looking real nice, but, like, she's probably going with the bullying, so she's probably a bitch, but... <laughs> I'm surprised the comments are not saying wood over here on the right side. <laughs> She's not new at this. Are you kidding me? She is not new at this. That was the most calculated camera zoom in into the biggest asset she has, bro. She is smart as fuck. Makeups? Alright. I don't have a good feel. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? This is the main character? Are we getting bullied? The girl's bullying us too on top of it. We're beginning to make content. This Makeup Gru's channel is making content out of us right now, bro. Lol. What the fuck? True. That girl looks important. Whoa! Latest Star Force PC, guys! <laughs> You know, I have heard a lot of people doing giveaways to like, basically, what, what is the point of a giveaway, right? If you like, if you share this video, if you comment on it, then we'll do a giveaway. Boost the engagement, right? More views. But like, how do you prove that you actually sent something? Don't a lot of content creators kind of do this shit, do bait engagements, and then don't even follow through on the giveaway? Look, I bait engagement all the time. This fucking title of this video is a bait engagement. But some people actually don't even follow up on the fake giveaways, bro. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what the fuck? It's not coming off because it's fucking makeup, bro. You can't just use water. You can't just use a regular cleansing uh, cleanser out there. You gotta use an oil cleanser. Did you guys know there's a thing called double cleansing? If you use makeup or sunscreen, what you need is a cleansing balm, an oil cleanser. And you rub, and then that gets rid of it, it emulsifies, and then you get a regular gentle cleanser, 
then you, that's the double cleansing part. Then it's clean. Then you put the moisturizer on. Then you put the serums or whatever toners actually before the moisturizer. And then you put the moisturizer on. And then you put the red. Anyways, I'm giving you guys too much uh, my secret 20 step uh, Korean skincare routine. Channel to look at 700k. 5k. Uh, everyone else has something. I've got nothing. I think that everyone has something. They just. This face is fucking crazy. <laughs> is this a Joker moment coming? Everybody has something. It just takes some time to figure out what you're good at. A lot of the times, you guys might think that you suck at something, but maybe. You're a fish trying to climb a tree. Is a fish supposed to climb a tree, guys? No. A fish is supposed to be swimming. Just remember that. Same. Jesus. What a piece of shit. God, wait, I'm, I'm, I need to ban that guy, bro. Whoever said that I look like this, he's not even a good character on top of that. Where, no, where, where, no, I'm, we're, get, we're getting him right now. We're getting him right now. Okay, maybe I kind of do look like him now. Fuck. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't. I don't look like him. <laughs> Does he suck at fighting? He's a pussy on top of that? He's a shitty fucking bully. He and as soon as the mention of the fight is hinted, he backs off because he's a pussy. He got a <laughs> just keeps getting worse. Just keeps getting fucking worse. <laughs> You know what the funniest thing is? If the main character wasn't here, because it's like the food chain thing, right? This guy would be the one that would be getting bullied by Paco, right? Bro. <laughs> YouTube. Yeah? Time to start a YouTube channel, guys? Everybody, let's all make a YouTube channel. That's actually pretty cool how they actually talk about this. Because, like, if you are a minor, if you're under 18, you actually can't do ad revenue directly. So, like, you need, like, a workaround, right? So, using your parents' account, right? So, the ad sense will be tied to your parents. Kind of cool. It's a real realistic. Who is this guy? Because the mom was in the hospital, right? <laughs> Maybe I was like, he was gonna say something like, Yo, with my YouTube account, I'll pay for your mom's hospital fees. But it's like, nah, let me borrow her bank. Fuck you! I'm gonna use my own mom's bank account to tie up to Aston so I can make my own money through YouTube. <laughs> true. Actually true. <laughs> can you fight though? Depression time. Well, this is our second webtoon anime. First is solo leveling. And second is this. Where the mom is always in the fucking hospital, bro. I swear to God, does every fucking webtoon anime gonna have a mom in the hospital? Yikes. No, mom, I fell down the stairs or some shit. Ooh. I bet she would know that he's lying about this. Oh. 30,000 yen money they, they made over the fucking lunch stream bullying us. One week's. And he has loan repayments, monthly hospital fee, monthly medicine, phone bill, bro. This is getting way too fucking real, bro. This is getting way too fucking real. It is kind of insane how much money like big content creators make, right? Because like, 
You know, you know the whole debacle of like, uh, uh, there's some streamers saying, yo, streaming is like harder than a nine to five, right? You remember that drama like a couple like uh, weeks ago? If you really sit back and think about it, like I, when I was like a line cook, dude, being a line cook in a restaurant is the hardest work I've ever fucking done. But at the same time, that was also the least amount of money that I've ever gotten. Right now, all I'm doing is fucking watching anime with you guys. This shit's making way more money than I was making fucking like pennies working as a line cook in a restaurant, bro. Like the amount that you work, the, the diff, like in this world, in capitalistic society, you don't get rewarded proportionally to the amount of hard work you put in. It's all about value. And this value is very subjective. A fucking kid could be opening up loot boxes on TikTok and be making the salary of a fucking 50 year old tenured man that's been in the same company for fucking 30 years and barely gotten, you know, uh, promotions. And when I started to think about shit like that, I was like, this is a really fucked up world. Like, this world does not reward you on how hard you work. No one gives a fuck how hard you work. It's about the intrinsic value that your work brings. And when I see people, like, even in this anime, this guy's right now fucking cooking, pat, flipping burgers, right? It's fucking hard work. Have you ever worked at McDonald's? I have. That was my first job ever. This shit is fucking grueling work. Dude, if, if you get oil fucking little splash on you, you can get burn injuries. You get paid fucking nothing. Like, it's hard fucking. And you got to deal with shitty ass people all fucking day. It's fucking hard work. 5,000 yen a day. Busting his ass. And those fucking bullies made 30k. Now, our main character, Hoban, because he's the main character of an anime, he should have a girl that's super hot and into him for no reason, right? Hey, hello. <laughs> Bomi! Ooh, Bomi! <laughs> you know where the beef patties are? You, you looking for my meat? What kind of meat you looking at? <laughs> yeah, you want some beef patties, girl? <laughs> What the fuck is this? Bro, stop! No one cares! You have 700k subs everywhere he goes! He enters a fucking restaurant! Hello, it's me, Paco, with 700k subs! Enters a library! Hello, it's me, Paco, with 700k subs! Go to the public bathroom! It's me, Paco, with 700k subs! Go home to his parents! Hello, it's me! Actually, he probably doesn't have parents. Because this motherfucker, this is some parentless behavior. I have a bad feeling that Bomi... Are we gonna get cucked? Like, what if Paco is fucking Bomi, dude? And we don't... Like, what if this is his fucking side hoe, bro? I don't feel good about this. Please. Whack Whack <laughs> what did you say? Look at the comments. These glazers. Such a cute smile. This is a cute smile. <laughs> Uh. Oh, bum! Yo, you ever see these TikToks of girls like in um Starbucks where they have like a bunch of tick? Like they go pretty viral. I've seen a lot of like um like quote unquote minimum wage workers right like, like going pretty viral on TikTok. So Bomi is the goddess of Wack Donalds who's been blowing up on social media because she's so hot. Is she a YouTuber, bro? This wasn't a range, he just fucking showed up. <laughs> so creepy, dude. So creepy. Hoban, do something. Hoban, make the sandwich for her. It's so creepy, dude. <laughs> Nobody asked him to do it. He just saying this shit. Oh, I'm so sorry, guy. I don't want to do this shit either, but my viewers are asking. Oh, you know, the viewers are out. I got to do it. I'm beholden to my viewers. Bomi looks kind of disgusted by him. I can't really tell. <laughs> Even I don't have Bomi's contact info. Are YouTubers allowed to do whatever they want? Dude, this anime is straight up just telling us, like, YouTubers are just gods in this world. They're just, like, above the laws. YouTubers are basically, like, Chebars in, Cor like, Korea. You know what Chebars are? I talked about this before in the other, uh, in the Gigguk video. But basically, it's just, like, the, 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 these four families that have control over everything in Korea. Samsung, LG, Hyundai, SK, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, YouTubers are gods here. 30 seconds! <laughs> But Bowie's supposed to do it, not you. 
he was right. Bro is fucking sweating, bro. 30 seconds to make it. He did say it was impossible. <laughs> Listen, I don't like bullies. And bro, Hobin is the main character, but that was... <laughs> he actually thought he's like the main character here. Did you see that, Bomi? <laughs> I just saved you. You know, you, you don't have to thank me right now. <laughs> Let me just walk away. Cool, see that? I'm the king of whack Donalds. Dubs and chat, guys. Dubs. <laughs> yeah, not cringe at all. Not cringe at all. Maybe she is sincere. Maybe she's genuine. I don't know. She has been making a lot of reactions. Her face has been kind of, mm. Whenever she was looking at Paco, it was kind of like, mm. But right over here, it's like, hmm. Hmm? Are we getting baited? We gotta be cautious. We got no way. You said she wants to whack D. Yeah, she wants her beef patties. Why is he at her place? What the piece of shit at her place? Why? Why would you go through with this? The bullying? Was it, was it just straight up just bullying? Like, we just skipped a lot, but like, what the fuck? <laughs> what is bro wearing? This boxer priest. <laughs> He just put spit in the ramen here. You see this? You see, he put the spit in the ramen for him. Is he cooking a meal for him too? I just realized, why would he be spitting into this? Because he's cooking a meal for this guy that fucking came over to his house and took his mom's bank information. What the fuck, Hobin? You're such a bitch. Bro, take a hold of your life. Yeah. Deserved. Oh, it's just a power. Never mind. Totally deserved. Finish him off with the fucking pot now. You're poor too, motherfucker! What do you mean? That is a crazy line. This is an unforgivable character. This is an insane fucking line, dude. Oh, the kimchi flap! Do you know what the kimchi slap is? <laughs> this is one of the most out of context K drama moments. We're getting a reenactment, but it's a two piece combo, bro. It's the it's the kimchi slap. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! Bro is dual wielding, literally going Starburst stream with two ferric fucking kimchi. What are we doing right now? Okay, the webcam's still on. The webcam is still on, so it's still streaming everything. The, the display was gone. Viral hit, does two dudes just duking out with kimchi? <laughs> Yo, how much money did they make from this stream? Wouldn't that be nice? Well, I know this is a pretty out of touch thing to say, probably. If only I've been born into a rich family. Like, rich people also has their own problems, right? Money, of, of course, like, people that's in poverty are going to have much more like immediate dangers because they don't have money. Like if you're paycheck to paycheck, you can't afford rent. You could be just homeless in a matter of a job. Like, yes, for sure, that is like a problem that is more significant than somebody having existential crisis because they're born into a rich family. But it's like at a certain point, when you've made enough money, it's like you get like a weird other set of problems, right? Suddenly, because everything, the bills are paid for, you, you're like this ghoul, this ho empty, hollow ghoul with like existential question asking like, what am I doing with my life? And at that point, it's like you need to have a sense of purpose because if you don't have a sense of purpose, if you don't have goals to strive for, then like you just become empty and then you get depressed and a lot of people actually become suicidal. So there's another saying like, um, I, I, it's a pretty 
random analogy, but like there's like people that's on the other side of the world that's like in like a third world country that has to get up at like four in the morning to pick fruits all fucking day and then come home and rest. Sometimes those people are more fulfilled and happy even though they don't have material wealth, even though they're not financially stable because their life is so fixated on like the immediate survival and being in a community, a tribe of people, you know, um, focusing on one goal, which is like fruit picking and coming back home and just still celebrating. Those people actually feel a lot more happy and fulfilled than like rich motherfuckers who are lonely, isolated, has nothing going on for them, got a bunch of money from their parents, but feel so empty because there's nothing fulfilling about their lives. So interesting thing to like ponder about. Like money is not your solution. It's definitely gonna help you with a lot of things that's going wrong in your life, but it can't really give you a purpose and you gotta figure that out yourself. <laughs> Bro should have fucking continued streaming, bro. They could have done like a sleep stream. Maybe people would have loved watching his sleep streams. Did it go viral? <laughs> Which one's your house? They all look the same. It's such a funny thing to say because it looks like CGI houses, but at the same time, it is true. A lot of these houses in Korea actually do look the same. <laughs> It was just for the screen. It was the display monitor. The stream was going, yep. I don't look like him! I don't! What are you guys are what are you guys are crazy? I don't look like him! I don't! <laughs> I don't. <laughs> okay. 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 How many views did it get? Yeah, how many views though? 10,000 comments is crazy! Is it going international? It's going international! Wait! That's actually funny that like... This is English? This is Japanese? The very bottom here is actually Korean. Even though this is like a... This is Korea. The very bottom... This is actually Korean. Asia? Uh, so funny lol. Best video ever. Wow. 하루 만에 전 세계가 보네. 전 세계가 보네. Which basically means wow. In, in like one day, the entire world has seen it. But you're making money now though. So it's worth it. No, no, don't delete it! The ad revenue! Yeah, they can. Did you just realize that views can be monetized, bro? What do you mean? How do you think they make money? Mm. Mm. 10,275,921 views overnight. One... Ten million views overnight? What the fuck? <laughs> the kimchi. <laughs> there he is, the YouTube star, guys. What the fuck kind of look at this? Are are they fans? Are are they predators? What the fuck? Why is she so goddamn thick? This piece is just gonna bully him now. This guy sucks. Oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Paco should be fucking making a video out of this right now. Holy fuck, dude. The facial reaction in this anime is so fucking good. Even him, look. <laughs> You're nothing to Paco, dude. He just used the line. You're already dead. He said the line. He said the line. He said the line. Jesus, what the fuck happens? 
Yeah. The power of new tubing. 11 mil views. 11 mil. I'm not gonna do No, I'm not gonna do this one. I'm not gonna do this one. No. So two things that could have happened here, right? Either he actually nut, either he actually nut, or it's just his balls breaking, right? Most likely it's balls breaking, but like one could interpret that he actually orgasmed. Yo, someone streamed this shit. Someone streamed this shit, yo. Someone needs to make a video of this. What are we doing? We're like... Oh! Oh, he was... Wait, he had a setup? Oh, bro, scheming. That is true. You have to, like, increase the stakes, right? You can't just do the same shit every time because people get bored of it. You gotta, like, spice it up. So how could you do it? <laughs> Business partners. Who doesn't, bro? Let's go! Dude, I think, like, there's a lot of moments in this anime. Even Hoban, when he had the money to pay for the hospital bills, their face becomes so fucking deranged. So this show is probably kind of, like, telling us that, yes, these are funny faces, but when humans are confronted with the opportunity to make a lot of money, suddenly they become fucking degenerates, huh? Look at this. His voice just changed! <laughs> yeah, you need a video, man, I guess, right? Broken did the edits, bro's a cameraman, broken make thumbnails, bro. Let's fucking go. Alright, alright. Let's do it. What a beginning of a twisted friendship, man. Yes, come back. Okay, he's still scheming though. I don't know. How how are we gonna split the money? So he's scheming. He's gonna go up the pecking order, but I feel like. He's not thinking big enough. Because he's still thinking that he is uh, Paco's bitch. Se Mr. 700k. What if we're Mr. 800k? What's the pecking order then? I feel like we can go beyond this if we just farm this content. <laughs> no, no man. No, hell no. No, 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 no. 80-20 me, you. Are you serious? 90-10? You gonna take that? Yeah, yeah, you're crazy. You're crazy. 90-10? What? Now here's the thing, because, like, he could find another producer. Like, he can't do what Hobin can. That's what he doesn't understand. Like, what do you mean 44? No, no, no. Drop it down. You should get 10. Hobin should get 90. Lower. Lower. Art of the deal, just walk away. And at this point, you say, 95-5, and we got ourselves a deal. And he's on his fucking knees crying, and we do a handshake. Hmm. Just fighting, right? I mean, we knew that from the trailer, right? Next! And that's the episode. What did you think? I thought this show was fucking great. It's not an isekai, it's not really a power fantasy. It's not any of the genres that we've ever seen. It is pretty much Korean Fight Club prank YouTube prank channel. So like the idea is the main content is we're going to go out in public and start shit and film the fight. And that's how we're going to farm it. And honestly, it's very realistic because people already do it. Fake prank channels. That's a thing. In fact, on TikTok, one of my favorite type of content, there's this dude that walks up to quote unquote gang members and throws up like gang signs and like says, what's up, homie? You want to fight? And then it's just trying to start shit with actual gang members and running away. Like it's probably staged, but that's kind of the idea what we're doing. We're going to people, we're starting shit, we're filming it, then we're fucking milking it for money. Why? Because it's a fucked up society we live in where hard work does not get valued. And the only thing that matters is the subjective value that the audience judges. And if people think that this is entertaining, then so be it.
that's what you decided. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Just like what I just said. If you guys enjoyed this video, that's all that matters, right? You gave me a YouTube algorithm. I have to make videos for what you guys actually want to watch. And if the market dictates that you guys actually want to watch this shit, we can got way more episodes of Farm. But that's it for me. If you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.